Hello, my name is Jeff Smith, and I'm the product manager for Oracle SQL Developer. And in the next five minutes, I want to take you through a walkthrough of the product features. Today, I'll be showing you version 3.1, which is available to download for free and use at no cost from Oracle Technology Network or oracle.com. This will run natively in Windows, OS X, or Linux and Unix environments. Once you establish a connection to your database, You'll have a worksheet where you can do your interactive querying, scripting, procedural work. And then you also have the object tree over here on the left where you can interactively click into objects and work with them. If I want to run a query, I can easily bring that up, execute that, get my data back, export this out to various formats. I can generate an explain plan. If I need more additional assistance with the performance of this uh, query or queries, I can also invoke the SQL Tuning Advisor. Uh, the SQL Tuning Advisor is an enterprise edition database feature uh, that's only available with the Diagnostic and Tuning Packs, so uh, this is not a free feature uh, provided by SQL Developer. This is a database licensed feature that you can use in SQL Developer. If I need uh, some assistance, if I'm not super comfortable writing SQL from hand, I can use our Visual Query Builder. This allows me to click in the columns, add criteria, add sort orders, and that dynamically changes the SQL statement for me. If I don't want to write any code whatsoever, I can click directly into an object using the tree. I can interact with the object so I can make changes here to this table. I can click into the data for the object. I can rearrange these columns. I can hide columns. I can apply sorts, and I can also filter the data. Right-clicking in a grid gives me a lot of the same functionality that I saw there in the worksheet. So I can publish this to an Applications Express report, or again export this to say PDF or Excel. If you need additional functionality than what we provide out of the box, using a little bit of SQL and XML, you can actually code your own custom extensions. Here I've created an extension where the tool will help me build a synonym. Something I enjoy about the tool will generally show you the SQL behind the GUI. So you can trust the code, reuse it, put it into your applications, etc. And I've also built an extension where the tool will show me all the synonyms I've created for my objects and I can click into those. Now if you're not comfortable uh, with the idea of having to write your own functionality, I understand that. We have other people that are willing to do that for you. So under help you can do check for updates and you can go into the third party extension list and see what's available there. Some of those are free, some of those aren't. Here's an example of one of those. So you can very easily uh, extend the functionality of SQL Developer just kind of like downloading apps onto your smartphone. Here's a uh, diagnostic monitoring solution uh, for your database that can run again natively right inside of SQL Developer. Talked a little bit about tables. We also support code objects. So your PL SQL functions, procedures. Here I have a function that has a syntax error. So I can actually drill in and kind of zoom into those errors. You can develop interactively right here in, in the browser. So if I want to compile this program, and now if I want to run it, and I get the program output directly right here in the tool. So no custom scripting to capture um, 
scalars that come back or ref cursors, all that good stuff. If I need to do database administration functionality, that's also built into the tool. Of course, assuming that you have the DBA level privileges, we handle everything from database configuration, uh, doing backups with a recovery manager or using data pump to move data around. We have an interface to uh, DBMS jobs and DBMS scheduler. You can manage security and of course storage using the tool. So I can click into a table space, add files on the fly. and terabytes if you want. And again, we always expose for you that SQL statement. If you don't have a database yet, but you need to build one, we also have a full-blown modeling solution built into the tool. So data flow diagrams, logical models, physical models, relational models. You can generate these. You can export them to various formats and you can print the diagrams to PDF or to an image. I would be remiss not to mention our reports. So the reporting interface comes pre-shipped with some data dictionary reports. And then we also allow you to create custom reports. So here's what I would call a, a master detail report. I have a chart object on top. I can click into one of these chart bars and then the data below refreshes and then I can export this data out as well. To customize a report, you seem to give us the SQL statements and then define how you want the data displayed. We even support HTML um, output. So, uh, left it to the last, but it's definitely not the least significant uh, feature. That would be our migration support. So SQL Developer is the official migration platform for moving your third-party databases to Oracle. So we include support for things like Teradata, MySQL, DB2, Sybase, Access, and SQL Server. And you can step through connecting to uh, the foreign database, capturing the objects and data, and moving them over into Oracle. And we can also help identify application code that's going to need translated and we even have a translation tool where we can take your T-SQL and rewrite that into PL-SQL. I want to thank everyone for your time this morning. If you have additional questions, don't forget to come to the start page and here you can access our tutorials, online demonstrations, documentation, our message form, and get training. Thanks and have a good day.